All right, what's up, TikTok? Hello from North Carolina. So this one is going to be about a client call that I had this morning, and it relates to the stories that we tell ourselves. And very awesome conversation with a new client, and she was telling me that she deals with a certain story from her past, that she's not good enough or she's not worthy. And we talked about how that kind of relates to self-sabotage and the reason why people do it. And I want to talk about this so that you can be aware of of how the world impacts the stories that we tell ourselves most of the time whatever happens in our relationships personal lives business and in in general life affects us negatively and over time it can allow us to start telling ourselves hey we're not good enough or hey we don't deserve this or you know we're only worth a certain amount of money at our job we're only worth a certain kind of partner or anything and anytime that something breaks the mold of that story and something good happens like you you meet a great partner or you get a great job opportunity it immediately scares you because it's it's over what you estimate your own self-worth to be and this can affect the story that you tell yourself and most of the time the stories that we tell ourselves are the ones that are imprinted on us from our parents from our brothers from our sisters from our friends at a very very young age So I want you to be honest, you can pause this video or you can do this after the video. And I want you to write out or try to explain what the biggest story that you tell yourself is. Hey, I'm not worth it. Uh, I'm not good enough, right? I'm not a great public speaker. I'm poor, I'm ugly, whatever it is, right? It can be the, the basis of anything that you want. And then I want you to write the complete opposite of that story, right? I am worth it, I am a beautiful person, I am strong, I am capable, I do deserve to make $200,000 a year, I do deserve a beautiful partner, I do deserve someone that cares about me, I do deserve a great family, I do deserve to drive a great car. Whatever these things are, I want you to write the complete opposite of the story that you probably tell yourself. And this is the exercise that I ran my client through, and if it doesn't make sense, comment down below or share your thoughts and, and feelings about this. But there's books about this, there's YouTube videos about this, And if you can constantly rewrite a story that you tell yourself, this is how you subconsciously will program yourself to start living a better life. I am worth it. I can do this. I am capable. All of those things impact the story that you tell yourself on a daily basis. Okay, just think about this. It's a very simple concept, but most people have a negative story that they consistently tell themselves, which allows them to self-sabotage, which allows them to not accept things that are actually good for them and keeps them limited in their own lives okay that's it pretty simple straightforward hit me up if you guys have questions just wanted to share that little tidbit have a great day